In today's news, a famous league streamer was held at gunpoint, Polypuff won a game without ever being seen, a ton of new exclusive skins we won't be able to get were announced, and the community speaks out against the state of Zed. For the first topic of today, No Way For You, famous German streamer was held at gunpoint and threatened with a knife. As we see in the video and images, an assumed bystander took of the assault, No Way calls for help in the police before the assailants hit him in the head repeatedly and yank him off the ground. This is obviously extremely scary for someone to have to go through. Luckily, he was okay, and he still somehow maintained positivity throughout it all, as we read in his tweet. The link to these events will be in the description. And for the next story of today, content creator Polypuff has just won a game against intermediate bots without ever being seen. The whole challenge was literally just that, win the game without ever entering the enemy's vision. Shown on the screen is the sped up version, showing how he is never seen by the enemy before their nexus goes down. This was achieved through playing Heimerdinger, whose turrets obviously did all the work. He hasn't published it yet, but for the full video, be sure to subscribe to his YouTube channel for the full thing. His link will be in the description. And just before we jump into the very big Zed problem, if you enjoy my videos, consider subscribing. We're very close to 100k, and you can always change your mind later. So for the main story of today, everybody fucking hates Zed. I don't think I've ever seen so many posts on the subreddit about one champion before, except maybe Zeri, so I decided to do some digging. Why is Zed in such a bad spot at the moment? Well aside from his extremely safe laning phase, being completely uninteractive until he has kill pressure at 6 with pickaxe or dirk, Zed can just farm from distance with his Q and pretty easily avoid any gank. So easily in fact, Korean Zed mains have begun taking teleport ignite as the champ just doesn't need flash at the moment, making his laning phase even safer. This, coupled with instant wave clear from Ravenous Hydra and insane roam potential have made Zed an earlier scaling AD Cassidy. Now the reason this strat is flourishing is in part to the development of W Max Z. It's been a pretty standard skill order of Max Q followed by E for maximal damage, but lately W Max after Q is the new wave, giving Z an extremely short cooldown gap close up by level 11. This was popularized by Korean One Tricks, Z99 and On Z. On Z even made a video about it recently, as you can see on your screen. And one such mechanic that is actually relatively unknown is Z's E and W interaction. For every champion Z hits with his E, it reduces his W cooldown by two whole seconds. At max rank, Z's W has a 14 second cooldown, and with full build around 100 haste, it goes down to around seven seconds. Now this still sounds like a fairly long cooldown, until you factor in that his W actually lasts five seconds, and the cooldown begins once his W is thrown out. Hit like one or two people with your E, and it's back up instantly with a downtime of only two seconds. Oh, and did you also know that any two abilities, like from his shadow and actual character, hit a champion, he restores energy? Yes, yeah, so maybe you're starting to see the problem. Check out this clip from Challenge EUSZ one trick Iljame using this mechanic to his advantage, literally titled Count How Many Times I W. Anyway, so far probably the most optimal thing people have suggested is his W cooldown starts after the shadow disappears, not while it's active, but I want to know how this should be balanced, let me know in the comments. And lastly for today, Riot showed off 10 exclusive chromas that all have really sick splash arts, but of course they're only for the Chinese server. To celebrate 10 years of the LPL, Sejuani, Vayne who got 2 I think, Lucian, Set, Yumi, LeBlanc, Malphite, Zoe, Fiora, Kaisar will all be receiving these chromas. As I said before, however, these will only be available for the Chinese server. For now, anyway. And that's all for today. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!